art district. It has been almost a month that we started it and uh, we are planning to paint 16, 16 large walls, large murals in Kannai Nagar. Almost 10 is finished, another 6 to go. We are planning to complete in another week or two. And uh, in this context, we had a discussion in Phoenix Mall today, Palladium uh, Mall today. It is regarding, you know, what is the impact and what is the, how we can take this project forward. So we had a very fruitful discussion and uh, I think we, we, can, we can take it a long way. Uh, CEO of Chennai Smart City Limited and I'm very uh, thankful to the uh, Phoenix Mall for organizing this because uh, what the Chennai Corporation has done is something spectacular in the uh, Kanagi Nagar. Uh, hopefully it will become a very vibrant art district. Yesterday there was a huge uh, community driven program where they not only uh, had their own art show and so on but uh, children were painting the walls. Celebration of art in that district and hopefully this will become a serious art district and one of the examples for the rest of the city also because we need to do many of them. So uh, I hope this is just the beginning of something wonderful. Thank you. And may I request like Vidya. And the project came across like thanks to the invitation of uh, the Greater Chennai Corporation uh, and the Smart City. Um, because uh, I think that the government saw in us like an opportunity of collaborating together to create what we call an art district. Um, that's what we are doing in Kanagi Nagar, um, which is like um, a little far away, so OMR. I don't know who uh, has been there or who knows about Kanagi Nagar. Um, has been for us like a very interesting area to sort of investigate and then try to sort of uh, take over while doing uh, many murals and uh, many interventions, but also community projects. So uh, here actually mm, uh, we wanted to sort of invite all the actors of, of uh, this project because we believe that public art is not just art in public spaces but it means to um, create like networks which then can sort of um, explode and explore other ways of approaching the territories. Uh, we are here in Palladium also because um, uh, Phoenix Market City and Palladium has been fostering like art uh, since a long time and uh, we wanted to sort of link different parts of the city uh, by different art interventions. So while we are doing uh, Kanagi Art District and as we speak uh, there are like three artists working, other four artists are going to work so overall there are going to be 16 murals. Uh, we wanted also to come in. Uh, I'm the CEO of Chennai Smart City Limited. Uh, in terms of uh, expansion, I think uh, India in general and Tamil Nadu in particular, I think public art is nothing new. Uh, you walk on many of the streets, the various uh, ancient buildings you can see, so it's a work of art in itself. But I think in the last uh, few years, you can see, in a few decades probably, uh, we haven't had that many public art like you see in uh, other uh, countries. So this is uh, a spectacular start and uh, there has been attempts earlier also to kind of figure out how do we bring more uh, public art into the into Chennai. So expansion for me would be, uh, I mean, for, I'm not an artist, yeah, but I know that art could be concrete, steel, water, laser, technology, non-technology, um, you know, inclusive, and so on and so forth, right? Uh, that, I mean, these are the things I keep hearing from my artist friends. Every Commissioner of South Region, Greater Chennai Corporation. Mm, uh, Coming to Chennai, I mean Chennai is a very creative city. Uh, in fact, we are a member of uh, UNESCO uh, Creative Cities Network. Our, we are very known for our, you know, the music festival, Madras Music Festival. Also, we have a very traditional and uh, very colorful dance festival also, which will happen every year. But when it comes to public art or painting and other sorts of, uh, you know, social arts, I mean, uh, as Raj was telling, I mean, we have, uh, the city has done various various steps at various points of time. But I think this is the first, you know, concrete and... Uh, uh, concrete. We are a collaborative platform for architects, urban designers and planners to make livable cities through participatory planning. Um, I think uh, one of the verticals of our work, uh, which is most relevant to this discussion, is art and the city. And under this... We look at like two components, one of them is research based where we actually study and analyze the impacts of the art on the city and in that sense we look at you know what it does to the physical environment, what it does to the social
socio-cultural impact, uh, what it, and as well as the sort of economic benefits of investing in the arts uh, as a city, at a city level. Uh, the other component of our work is actually directly related to the praxis part, where we actually use art as a medium for participatory planning as a process. And what we did at Kanegi Nagar as part of the festival uh, was also something similar, because uh, we had uh, two projects. One of them was the postcard project, where we actually sort of mapped all the different games that the kids in Kanagi Nagar play, and uh, the postcards will then be sent out. In fact, I'd like to invite if anybody would like to. We are yet to paint in Kanagi Nagar. We are, we are starting tomorrow, um, and uh, we just finished and wrapped up a community art project in Dharavi for 25 days. Um.